I'd like to thank uh, the Ministry of Health. Uh, we received an ambulance uh, vehicle. Uh, it's now uh, on the road. We have been facing some challenges with uh, an ambulance vehicle. As you can see, that was one of the ambulances that we have been using that I came with. So we, we are now at another level. We are now able to collect patients. As you have observed from the phone calls, the challenge is uh, when you test a patient uh, in, the, in, the, uh, in the village, uh, you isolate the patient there, and the worst you are monitoring that patient, that patient might develop complications uh, during that course of illness. Then we need to pick that patient to come to the hospital. So that ambulance has been doing that. And also after discharge, people have no means of uh, collecting their loved ones from the hospital to their homes. We are also using that ambulance to take those patients from the hospital, delivering them to their homes, and also emphasizing the issue of, 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 of emphasizing the preventative methods they are supposed to be following at their homes. So, we'd like to thank the Minister of Health for, for that uh, for that help. So far, so far. We now uh, have three ambulances. We so now have three functional ambulances in, in the district. Taka tarisa pa jini, cha taka itikiru wa jina chekirini kina hii di mnanga kwa ndi utaka batiri kani kutikunu kwa tati chienda isusu jumba echenge kati kure tati chifamba 10 km tijitasa wa taifa na wakwenda kumount kana kuweza kana kwa ramba ni pasi kukara pa kirini ndo kwa tati chienda saka hizo zituru kufara atisiku toze wakuti toi tasei tiru kufara ni chiti kwa cha taka itiru wa ichukuti taane kirini kwa edu opa duze icha batiru ona araunda yese Yangai juu famba ten kilometers kutoa chuo ge klinik, yenu cha kungo sumuga wa kutoongo yenda kana ne bara kana ne soka zako mno wa kwanza kuend, saka shoda kutoendwa ish. Kuvapana pa kwenye kuweza, ma kilometers mangan? Inubii fifteen. 